Thanks for joining us for another episode of Top 5 Gadgets in a brand new format of podcast. Thank you, listeners. In this episode, we take a look at the latest in office technology. Oh, this is another Red Dot winner from 2018 for product design, the Cusa Aura. I can't share with you yeah. how yeah. excited I am look, right look now. At that. I mean, firstly, I just want to take a moment to look at that packaging. That is Apple levels of beauty. I really like it. Yeah. I really like it. From this point on, yeah. all I think about is having it. <laughs> yeah. Well, it's to stay. I'll let you. I'll let you open up the Cusa Aura that while is, I explain what it is. is. I mean, just from the box, it's beautiful. Yeah. I, I've got these little notes written here. Okay. So for those of you that are wondering what the pink thing is. Oh. Yeah. That's it. There we there go. Is, there's a little letter in here. So the Cusa. Oh. To Pete. Uh, it doesn't say we this. We hope you enjoy your new lamp. It's not a lamp. Torch. It's not a torch. You don't know what it is yet. It's whatever is in this box is for you, <laughs> which is nice. Okay. So there's a little letter with So it. let me tell you what's in the box. Please. Yes. So the Cusa Aura is a portable, foldable desktop book scanner. Now, before you switch off thinking that's nerdy, this is one of the coolest electronic gadgets I've seen to date. This thing is amazing. Oh, wow. I've got, oh, I've got to do some assembly here. A little bit of assembly. Well, this is an unboxing experience that we're sharing. Okay. So this will scan open books face up and will turn them into flat, readable digital documents. Does that make sense? Makes total sense to me. Yes. Do you know how I'd abbreviate that, though? Yeah. This has got some cool technology in it because, let's face it, we don't want to know how it works. Right. That means that you can take a photo album of your family, put it underneath because, let's face it, nobody looks at photo albums anymore. Yeah. Hold it out. It turns it into a digital photo. And then you can view all of that through an app. But smarter than that. Yeah. You hold it out underneath. Obviously, the pages are going to be bent because it's a book or a photo yeah. album, it flattens those out and turns them into flat, single images. Or indeed, if it's a Word document, it'll turn it into a PDF, a Word document, a spreadsheet. Yeah. As a digital file. If it's wonky, it will straighten it. If your finger's in the scan, it will remove them. It takes two seconds to scan a single A4 page. Right. One, That's really quick. Two. It's done. Um, and there's clever modes. That like you pointed out, there is a foot control so you can just scan with using a foot thing which let's face it if i've got both of my hands yeah. holding a book open you're going to need a foot free yeah or you can set it into auto scan mode that once it's done the two second scan it'll detect when you've changed the page and then start scanning again that's the one that i want to use so for people that are running large offices that have got huge archives of paper that the idea of running those through a scanner is going to take you years this just speeds that up really quickly or indeed like you say if you've got old photo albums and you want to digitise them quickly, then something like this is absolutely perfect. Turn an old photo into a digital JPEG in an undistorted, perfect way. That is what the Cusa Air Aura is for. And um, it is an absolute thing of marvel, isn't it? Do you know, it's, it's a beautiful thing to have on a desk. It's a beautiful thing to have on a side cabinet at home. I love the fact that it turns into a lamp. Now, obviously... Yes, side, side lamps, yeah. This, this lamp attachment is meant to distribute more light for when you're doing your scanning. Or also, it's, it's a separate function, they say, that you can just use it as a reading lamp if you wanted to. And it's a beautiful lamp. Isn't yeah. It? And I think that's what they've done really well here. They've, they've made something that is super modern looking. Yeah. It's clean. And this is a unique design. We all know scanners of old, so you, you've got a flatbed scanner, they're called, and yeah. you have to put it in and close the lid. What a unique idea. Um, 
Um, what a fantastic innovation. Yes, again, it's a bit different from what we'd normally cover, but it's too unique a gadget to ignore. Yeah, I, th- I think for very obvious reason as well, it's in that pursuit of the top five gadgets of all time. When you come across something that is a scanner, you go, well, we've seen scanners before. Mm-hmm. But it's also a lamp. Mm. Well, I haven't seen a lamp that scans before. And then you start finding out about the AI. Yeah. How once it scans something, it can correct it into a, like a PDF format. So it straightened it all up it, rather than just a photo. Or oh, an page. editable Word document. Incredible. So uh, searchable PDFs, editable Word documents, editable spreadsheets, automatic page detection. So not only will it detect when you've turned a page, but also it's obviously seeing two pages at once, isn't it? Because it's an open book. It automatically separates page one and page two. Yeah, that's genius. I was, was going to get into these um, these little finger gloves. Yes. They look like little thimbles. Yeah. Um, they're bright yellow. You kind of, when you're holding the page flat, yeah. the AI recognises those from the pattern that's on them and it will delete those out. It's so incredible. That, so they don't show in, in any of the, the scans that are finished. But um, yeah, I like it. I like the fact that they've considered all the little details. So the background of the pages is this finished black. Yeah. That's nice if you're putting some photos down to scan in. There's nothing offensive. It's not an old, dirty coffee stain on the table. Yeah. You've got a clean surround, a clean mat surround as well. But out of everything, I just think it's quite beautiful to look at. It is a beautiful gadget, isn't it? And the fact that it will fold down and literally you set that on your desk. I mean, that's unobtrusive, no profile. Oh, I need to do a scan. Well, there you go. I'm ready to scan. Right. Now, this attachment, I've just seen the electrical part where that clips into. So that goes over, that meets up with this piece here. Yeah. Did you see the hole on the back? Yeah. And that just clips in. Wow, it's that easy. Yeah. Yeah, literally that easy. And then you have uh, side lamps as well, so you can read. It's it's a beautiful gadget. Pretty cool, isn't it? I, I Just anything that's kind of electronic, but once you start integrating AI... Yeah. Okay, let's face it. None of us are ever really going to understand how that thing's programmed to do the things it does. No. Nope. But... From the video, we've seen the, the work in progress that um, as it's doing its thing, as it puts a grid down on the page, the AI turns it into exactly what we need as an end result. Really, that's all we care about. From the rest of it, it's just a cool-looking gadget to have in the home, to have in the office. Yeah. And that is why it's worthy of being on the show. Yes, it has a worthy contender for its place in our search for the top five gadgets. Well, Pete, that about wraps up our look at the Caesar or Kusa, however you want to say it, Aura. I say, I say Caesar Aura. You say Caesar Aura, I say Kusa. I think it's probably Caesar now you've said that. Um, but you know what? Yes. I've got one problem with this, AJ. What's that? It's too big to put in my pocket and take home. It's not an everyday carry, which is the normal for our channel. This is the ultimate bit of office technology. Um, I've been really blown away by it, and I think it has a worthy place in our quest to find the top five gadgets. Which is what this channel's all about, and if you like that type of thing, make your, make sure you're subscribed, which is just over there. If you don't like this type of thing, if you think, nah, 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 not for me, thank you. No way. Make sure you hit that thumbs up button just to let us know, really. And if you've got ideas or you've seen a gadget, maybe it's a Kickstarter, maybe there's something exciting happening out there that you want us to know about, then drop it in the comments below. And for everything else, I don't know, use your phone, call a friend, have a talk about it. Mm. You'll feel better. Yeah. Or maybe just share the video. That's probably what you to do. Share the video. Share the video. So uh, that's all for this one, AJ. Yeah. So until the next time, bye. I just end it with bye. Just bye. Bye. <laughs>